Uh, good morning everybody. This is Max from Dragon Fruit South Africa. Um, this is just a little short video to um, show you guys about the rust that you can expect um, on the dragon fruit if the soil don't drain um, so well and uh, if your dragon fruit plant receive uh, too much water. Um, it will basically start off with like, um, a, a, it looks like almost like an acidy type of um, a, a, a bit of an orangeness on, on the leaf. Um, I don't know if this video is clear enough to see that. Um, and uh, this is like the beginning stages of uh, the infection on the leaf. And um, then basically it will form almost like a crust like uh, you will see on, on this leaf here. It will have a bit of an um, elevation. Um, if you if you turn the leaf, it looks like it's building out a little bit uh, from the leaf. Um, it's um, it's necessary to to treat it. Um, it won't kill your plant um, at all, um, but it will definitely you know damage your quality of your your plant. Um, uh, there there are some sy systemic fungicides that you can use that's working perfectly for for this problem. Um, and, and also in the early stages you ca can basically prevent it by um, applying a, a, a copper, um, a, a copper leaf um, mix that you can spray on your leaves and that will protect your plant for um, getting this um, in infection. And also um, importantly if you can spray your plants with um, uh, something like a neem oil, it's not necessary that's just an extra step that you can take and neem oil is very very good for any type of plant and um, leaf problems but um, this is not a major issue but it can spread very rapidly so it's important that you um, when you see the signs um, when you see the signs of infection to treat it um, uh, immediately uh, what the fungicide will do it will um, it will stop um, it will stop uh, the what do they call it? It, it will stop um, the spreading um, and and it will basically uh, kill the the fungus so it won't give off any spores in the air um, so your other plants can't get affected. Um, I just want to show you plants that have been treated. Um, it will automatically like this one over here. Uh, this one, this. Uh, is already uh, beginning to die off this um, infection um, what it will do it will eventually dry and it will start to peel like like this like, almost like skin um, it's hot it's like you know just just peeling off your um, peeling off your dragon fruit leaf and um, it will just leave your plant with a bit of scar tissue um, just want to show you quickly like this one here. I just want to put it in the sun. Um, scar tissue and, and that's it. And um, you are rid of, you got rid of that, um, that pesty rust that's on your plants. But um, it, it's not necessary to, to stress a lot. Um, it is treatable and uh, very effectively I might add. So that's just a short video to show you um, on, the, on the rust side of the plant. Um, you know what to do. Um, if you guys look on the um, Dragon Fruit Forum South Africa uh, Facebook page, there are some um, more detail about the uh, fungicide you can use and also um, the copper mix. And uh, I will make sure to load it on the website for Dragon Fruit South Africa as well for all the guys that might experience this problem. Thank you so much for watching. Goodbye.